How to replace the thermal paste in a laptop. At the request of fans, today we're replacing the thermal paste on the Lenovo ThinkBook 14 G3 ACL 2021. Tutorials for replacing and upgrading thermal paste on laptops are available in the main tutorial collection on our homepage. You can also comment with your model if you need specific guidance. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Step 1. Get tools ready. Many tools are needed to replace the laptop's thermal paste. Apart from the thermal paste and thermal paste cleaning wipes, some gadgets can help you to disassemble the laptop much more easily. If you don't want to buy them separately, you can find our total solution combo in our profile. Step 2. Remove the laptop case and battery. Before you start disassembling the computer, it's highly recommended to wash your hands or wear gloves or an anti-static wristband to eliminate static electricity. Place the laptop with the bottom facing up, and using a PH0 screwdriver, loosen the six captive screws on the bottom cover in a top-down order. Then, remove the four screws at the bottom. It's advised to use a magnetic mat to avoid mixing or losing screws. Prepare the triangular pry tool and spudger. Insert the triangular pry tool from the top and pry open the cover along the edges. Once the bottom cover is opened, use the spudger to unplug the power cable. To remove it, simply push the connector outward with the spudger. After removing the power, remember to press and hold the power button for 15 seconds to discharge any residual power. Step 3. Remove the heatsink and old thermal paste. Using a PH1 screwdriver, remove the five screws that secure the cooling module in a right-to-left order and place them on the magnetic mat. Use a high-quality screwdriver, such as the Cooling Monster Combo 01, and apply vertical pressure to prevent stripping the screws. Use the spudger to disconnect the fan power cable. Gently pry open the heat sink. Slowly lift both sides of the heat sink with your hands to remove it. To clean the old thermal paste more efficiently, we recommend using Cooling Monster Clean 01 Thermal Paste Cleaning Wipes. If you're worried about getting your hands dirty, you can use the disposable gloves included in our kit. Here you can see, the thermal paste on the processor has dried up after years of use, reducing its cooling efficiency. It needs timely replacement. Step 4. Clean the fan. Using a PH000 screwdriver, remove the four screws that secure the fan. Here, we use an anti-static brush and compressed air for cleaning. Gently lift the fan and use the anti-static brush to clean the dust off the fan blades, then clean the dust off the heat pipe. When using compressed air, maintain a small distance to avoid spraying liquid. Compressed air is very effective for cleaning fine details and improving cleaning efficiency. After completing this cleaning, don't forget to clean the dust on the motherboard and backplate. Step 5. Apply Thermal Paste. Here we used Cooling Monster Cold 01 High Performance Thermal Paste. Apply an appropriate amount of thermal paste on the surfaces of the CPU and GPU. After applying the thermal paste, you can use the spatula to evenly spread out the thermal paste and remove the excess. You can also use the P-Size method if you like. Step 6. Reassemble your laptop. Reassemble the fan and heatsink. Tighten the screws diagonally to 70% tightness, then fully secure them after all screws are in place to avoid excessive stress. Reattach the first screw securing the fan. Gently place the cooling module back in position. Using a PH1 screwdriver, tighten the five screws in a right-to-left order.
Reconnect the fan's power cable. Use the spudger to insert the power cable back into the motherboard. Close the laptop back cover, snap the clips into place, and tighten the four screws at the bottom and the six screws on the back cover. Follow and subscribe to Cooling Monster and let us know which laptops to demo this process with next.